Start with your power one. You ready? Mm -hmm. Classwork is a little different here at the Academic Therapy Center. D. Just ask Wyatt Ray. Today I did creative writing. Wyatt sees things a little differently. It's hard to read and you feel kind of upset. He has dyslexia. His kindergarten teacher picked up on it pretty quick. Wyatt's dad, Dustin Ray, is talking about when his son started to struggle early on in public school. We didn't realize it early on, but there's an emotional component too. When he's seeing all the people in his class progress and he's being left behind, uh, it, was, it was difficult for him, difficult for us. So Dustin and his wife recently pulled Wyatt out of public school, now homeschooling him. It's easier for him. Consonant is gonna be. He's now also getting some unique one-on-one -on -one work. How to learn how to read using multi-sensory techniques. So this gives you how your body makes the sound. Regina Staffa is a licensed dyslexia therapist who decided to take this career route when she found out all three of her kids have the disorder. I kind of found it to be my passion. She says learning cursive reduces the workload on the brain for someone with dyslexia. Allows you to really think about what you're writing and not how you're writing it. Which is why she's glad it will be back in the Texas school standardized testing this fall. It really helps everybody write what you want to say better and faster and quicker. And Dustin is glad to finally see his son grasp what he's learning. Now when we say, hey, what did you learn today? He can not only tell us, but he shows us and he's excited about it. Not only can Wyatt's dad see the difference. My Mac was in a tube. Wyatt can too. It's making me learn how to write cursive better.